This is inspiring. A Kent State men's basketball player made a historic debut tonight. Kalen Bennett didn't walk until the age of four, didn't talk until he was seven. But last fall, he became the first athlete with autism to sign to a Division I program. News 5's Amanda Van Allen introduces us to the athlete who keeps defying the odds. The crowd is going nuts. The cheers are loud. And the team is up by what might as well be a million points. But tonight's not about any of that. Tonight's about history in the making. I'm just one person. This humble powerhouse is Kalen Bennett. He's a freshman on Kent State's men's basketball team. It's good to know that people look up to me, but the real thing is everybody's capable of doing whatever they want to do with life. Kaylin is the first ever person with autism to sign on with a Division I sports program. And now he's the first to ever suit up and score a college basket. A lot of kids dreamed of getting their first college bucket like that, so for it to go in for me, I was really happy. Although right now he's working on getting better and earning more minutes, he realizes his success is so important to so many people. From now on, everything I do, every step I take, I have to make sure it's with order and it's with resolve. Especially to his biggest and loudest fan. He never doubted himself. He, he knew he was going to do it. And so all I had to do was just support the dream. That's Kaylin's mom, Sonia Bennett. I'm going to be nervous. I'm mom, you know. <laughs> She's committed to his success, both on and off the court. She moved all the way to Kent to support him. My son told me that I was going. He said, I can't do this without you. And so if he called, I'm coming. That's just it. Sonia says she's so grateful for all the doors basketball opened for him. Basketball gave him the tools to be social. Basketball gave him friends when he was alone. Basketball gave him the skills to know that he could do anything he wanted to. As he said, with this little orange ball, it could take me wherever I want to go. And so is he. Hopefully I create a thing where it's going to transcend to more kids that they believe in themselves. First and foremost, Amanda Van Allen, News 5.